Like, damn, I'm, I'm just thankful that I don't really have to do that much. But against characters like, uh, like, with, like, char- like moves that don't snap like what, like, about, it's, it's a pain, it's a, it's a huge pain to deal with. And you really have time yourself well. Oh, yep. the match starting. Oh, the match is starting. Alright, let's, let's watch. That's a flock to both players. Starting on PS2, a fairly neutral stage for both of the characters. Yep. And it seems that both characters, yeah. have, both players are trying to find an opening. Yep. And it seems that Ozel has found it first with his ever so signature side B. Yes, the Fire Emblem classic. Yeah, first, uh, the classic. Uh, but Trash has. Uh, he managed to get back to stage with uh, yep. Will and has now turned the tides entirely. And Ozel slightly has slight disadvantage. Ozel's SP is really not good for him in this matchup yeah. right now, as yeah, it indeed. seems. Yes. Oh, Trash with the foots too, but unable to um, get yeah, anything out of it. Yes. Okay, okay, Pyra versus uh, Lucina. The matchup we're talking about just now, which seems that. Oh, uh, no, okay. Mithra's back. <laughs> oh, okay. It seems that Trash oh. was, not, um, con- was not confident in the MU. And now we are back to fairly, fairly neutral. Yeah, oh, nice. trying to space all his areas as much as possible. Yeah. I think in the MU, he's, he should try to play, especially against Pyra. He should, he should, uh, should try to uh, anti air Pyra more. Because that's the side, like, like how you play against Pyra. Like, that's the main way to beat Pyra's huge aerials. Then I, mean, I think 40s in general like to jump a lot. Yeah, if I'm safe, air smash on shield, trash ends uh, Oza's first start with uh, B. Uh, like, like, pretty much just uh, like eater, but uh, with less sauce and no spam. Oh, oh that's good break. Nice read from Ozel. If, yes. It seems like Trash didn't really consider the option, even though like he has a new thrust and has mobility to make him move out of the way. But we'll, we'll see how we deal with that in the future. The threat of uh, Shield Breaker. And once again, we're fairly even with Trash and Ozel just hopping around neutral. Ah, Foresight. Ah, what, what a move. Why a bit? Yeah, it's it's, it's 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 a nasty move, and but but Ozel taking advantage of the Lucy, uh, of like um uh Trash's habit to like spot dodge a lot, which is honestly valid since it's like foresight is so broken and manages to turn the tide. And now he's he's he has uh Trash on the back foot with a oh, different situation back. again. Yeah, nice and tight. And see right. that Trash is landing with up tilt. Yes. Okay, but now uh, with Trash has uh, reset. Oh, not going to reset. Yeah, they seem to oh, yeah. generally reset to neutral and they're just playing oh. a, a some. I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure we've seen us up even with that. Yeah, more slightly. This just RB is also really strong. Oh, but he has swapped again, once again to Pyra. Oh, Pyra. Oh, yeah. I thought he, he was going to make it. Oh, okay. The. O- Ozel unprepared for the shockwave of uh, of blazing and was this? Yeah, sometimes I'm also not prepared for it. Yeah, same. It's, it's, it's a nice it's, it's, Yeah, it's a fairly but fast by, 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 by this yes. predictable, you're gonna get punished really hard yeah. for it. Uh, uh, I believe Ozel saw it coming, but unfortunately, he stand up. He stood a bit too close. Comfort and oh, uh, the roll read. Nice, nice roll read from Trash and even and once again, it's okay. Once again, sure they are. Once again, they are playing neutral with Ozel possibly searching for a kill. Ah, uh, the unsafe back air of getting Ozel punished heavily. Uh, Trash is not making it easy for him. Yeah. The, the Trash's current like uh, strategy to simply play outside of Ozel's chat range is, is, is working really well. He's been able to punish a lot of Ozel's like, slightly unsafe options. Even those that are not unsafe, he's been able to punish because Mirifra is just that strong. Yep. Ages. Uh, and <laughs> yep, pretty much. And now Pyra has back in play, and Ozel has been. Oh, Ozel uh, managed, yeah. managed to get the kill right. on the uh, unsafe I mentioned earlier. And once again, we are sort of neutral, sort of neutral again. Oh, but trash with the the read and the side B, and once and Ozel is 
Once again, uh, move. neutral. Yep. Okay, now the side B. Okay. Watch out. And okay, Ozel tries to set up a late stretch situation. Ozel oh, seems but... to be eager for going for an edge guard. Yeah, he does. No, he, he does seem to go for an edge guard on the contrary. He's been playing very safe with the Aegis, and I, um, I guess he gets uh recovery. And I and I think that he should be a bit more brave and try to go for a bit more. Because Lucina's edge guard is, edge guard game is really strong. And it's, it's, it's really strong to oh, oh no no Yeah, it's a really good idea to try and game Happy the done. character Yeah That is very sad Yes, um, Ozel being a bit too eager with the shield break trying to get a kill Which is unfortunate So, how do you think that like, uh, Ozel should adjust for like, the next match? Okay, assuming he isn't here uh, <laughs> Actually, to be quite honest, I, I myself wouldn't know because I don't play Mufusina either. <laughs> uh, okay. Well, um, okay, in my opinion, um, okay, wait, coming from... And, yeah, from what I say, from my as, as an ex-Lucina player, I think you should really try to go out there a bit more. And learn how to challenge uh, Pyra's un like aerials, rising aerials, with stuff like, Nair, like rising Nair, or just sit, try to up to her as she's coming down. Because, yeah, maybe uh, he, maybe yeah. now that I think about it, maybe he's trying. He should try setting up for more like juggles. Yeah, mo it's more slightly yes. Because the okay. will be in Mithra again. Because yeah, what's new? Yes, but um, Prem. No, no sorry, Prem. Uh, sorry, uh, Ozel does seem to have somewhat of a read on Treasure Spot habits. Even though I think from from the last okay, from what it felt, uh, Trash was already slightly adapting to Ozel's habits for being side B. So uh, we'll see, um, you see the players will adapt the next round. I mean, yeah, Trash did catch uh, with her off uh, side B as the first option to mix yeah. up sometimes. Mm -hmm. Yep. But I feel that Lucina doesn't have incredibly strong burst options. It, like, as like, okay, not as strong as, uh, not as strong as Mithras, but it's, it's okay, yeah. So the Xeno Spark, uh, best of luck. <laughs> you need it, you play baller on you, yeah, good luck. Okay, they have counterpicked to small battlefield, which is uh, once again a very neutral stage for the both for both of these characters. Oh, oh side. Damn. Ah, that move, that move. Okay, a fairly so far fairly even start from both players. They seem to be very content just playing neutral. Oh. The back air cost him uh well. And same back air trying to call out um trashers um out shoot options. Side BS recovery. Uh, Ozel goes. Uh, we, we, I think he dealt, Yeah, he tried. He tried to read the jump, but um, wants to pick a pretty unsafe option to do so with to do with. And now, okay. Oh, Ozel's got a juggling situation. Yep. Okay, he's, oh, he's managed he, to put it off stage. He, oh, oh, oh he has a, he that's that. That's that. Yes. Yeah. See, Ozel is definitely adapting to the MU. Good for him. Okay. And let's see oh, how Trash... Almost got him. Almost got him. Oh, okay, a rare is side B, but Foresight is coming to save him again. Okay, okay. Ozzy are managing to reset. Reset no, to sorry. neutral and holding... Okay, he was holding center stage, but he just gave it up. And once again, Trash is... Trash has... Oh, okay. Trash getting Both a kill. players are more willing to commit into stuff right now in this in this match compared to the yeah, first one. Yeah, they, they, they are both committing much harder. Oh, side. Wow. Oh, down they're not gonna connect to the side B because of yeah. Fortnite. Fortnite existing. Is Fortnite? Okay, now man. Well, I, 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 I pretend I wouldn't hear that. Okay, I say yes. For, I say for side. For side. Okay, my bad. I hear it. I heard it wrong, my bad. But yes, um, it seems that um, Mifra side B is giving um, Trash a lot, a lot of damage in this MU. Especially, especially as like a burst option to catch Ozel like outside his, his in the range he is he's usually like uh, a custom for me for the plane. And it seems that I was the oh yeah. he's gonna get punished for doing that laggy side B. Yeah, once again unsafe side B. And another and, side yeah, B. I, there's so many unsafe side Bs this run. Jeez. These people need to check those. But yes, okay, so as a result, uh Ozel has trash in the as in the Disadvantage again in a dash situation, and he seems content on holding central stage, whereas Trash is taking his yeah, chances. I think I think, Oz I think Ozel is like more prepared for the side B mix up right now. 
Yeah, it definitely seems like it. He's playing very effectively outside of the burst range of Kyra. But uh, it seems that... Okay. A nice, nice read from... He should have went for a counter there. That would have entered his stock, I think. Possibly, maybe. but how counter might not work sometimes. Uh, it, it didn't work for me a bunch of times when I was playing against Trash. I don't know. Whenever and, I and, use Roy as counter against Aegis, it always works out for me. And, and uh, Ozel dying to the straight back air from Pyro. Incredibly strong move that comes out from the bottom. Uh, okay. okay. And once again, they are playing, they're trying to play neutral with a. Uh, let's both of them going back and forth, taking turns at uh, trying to. Like, Press for the. Yeah, oh. trying to open each other up. Missed opportunity for Jago. Yes. And Trash with uh, Up B calling out. Uh, no, not Trash. Ozel with Up B oh. calling out Trash. Is not safe. He tried to go for a read, but got stuffed out by Side B. Yes. Okay, trash seems to be unable to. Oh, not sorry, oh. Trash. Caught his own with F tilt. Yeah. And Ozel seems to be unable to um, H guard Trash again. Like, unlike the first stop. And we'll see if that will uh, affect his chances of bringing this round. Oh, this could be potentially it. Okay, Ozel oh. with the patience, and he, well, he almost got off ledge there, but it's unfortunately sent to the other side. One arrow should be able to kill Lucina, I think, right? Yeah, now. it's a very high very situation. Yep. Yeah, very scary for but, him. Yeah, but Ozel has still has a chance to bring it back. You can see, like the the weak recoveries of both the both of the easiest girls are like uh, highly exploitable by Lucina. So if Ozel plays his cards right, he might be able to re catch out this round for Kim. That's only if he gets the edge guard situation. And seems to have he still seems to have a fairly strong grasp on Trash's um edge guard uh, not edge guard sorry uh, spot dodge habits. In Trash doesn't seem to be changing up for the time I'm being. I'm not used to seeing Pyra side be not uh, like. Because normally, once you get hit by one of the moves, you're dragging into the rest of the multi hits. Yeah, it seems to. It seems to yeah, it's not working for some. Oh no! Oh, the bad DI. Oh, nah. That's it's unfortunate. unfortunate. That's unfortunate. But uh, nice, nice mix up from Trash and uh, congratulations. Uh, well, well played, well played, both players. And okay, so well, Zeno Spark seems to be fighting Ozel and losers. Oh, best of luck with him. Oh, okay. Com sound comp it's not very confident, Zeno Spark. What are we, which is the next set? Ah, I assume it's Noodles versus Bean. Do you know who Bean? <laughs> Bean? I'm not too familiar with him. I, no, I don't think I've heard him. Yeah, I actually, nope. He seems to be a NES player. Yes. And, yeah, a NES. I'm not very confident in my MU knowledge about NES versus ICs of Kirby. Um, I, I have. Only only has, like, I only know two NESs, it's just PSI Force and Sine Wave. Yeah, and I don't think I've ever talked to them in depth about MUs regarding like Kirby or ICs. Because <laughs> yes, no, okay. Next set is Winners Finals, okay, I see. So it's Prem versus Trash. Okay, 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 two oh, Wolf versus Aegis. Yes, Wolf versus Aegis. Uh, both fairly competent players, once again. I'm he Prem being... Space, he likes to uh, mix his neutral with like, some jumps and everything. But mm, yes. I have a feeling that Aegis, the Aegis side B may be able to stop that out easily. Yes, it's a possibility. For him. Yes, um... Yes, uh, with Prem as the previous second place for the tournament, and uh, Trash has um, uh, like he's, he's, he's been around but he hasn't won anything big yet. Will, this, will we see our first up, uh, major upset of the tournament? The, mm, do you have... Who knows? It who depends, knows? Uh, right? it depends on the type of player of course. But yeah. In matchup terms, uh, it, it seems like Aegis is in the favor of this one. Yeah, like definitely. Always. Definitely. Uh, Mifra can definitely and can zone break Wolf very easily. With her speed and like her, and like her, her disjoints will will probably be able to stuff out a bunch of like wolf's like, aerials. But wolf does have a very solid two framing game with F tilt and with like, F tilt and down smash and maybe that is off stage. 